Looking good, huh? Real good. Whew. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another one. Uh, lay down blind in a corn field. The best, the best corny, corny field that we've hunted all year. Uh, it's straight corn. There's no wheat planted in. So it's lay down blind time and full bodies only. A lot of snows in here and a lot of lessers and a lot of specks. There's just a huge ton of, ton, ton of geese. But. Can everybody hear me? Yeah. Good yeah. to go? I know a lot of you haven't hunted out of lay down blinds, and a lot of you have. Um, first thing, which if you're right handed, keep that, keep it, the, the stock of the gun next to your hip. Right when the hip. birds, when, yep, when the birds are coming, keep holding your gun, you know, keep it in your hand. I usually put it up on my hip. Um, obviously, say, keep it on safe at all times because you're going to be buffaloing and walrusing around in there and you can you can bump it really easily um, when you set up to shoot hold your gun and set up don't open the doors with your hands just hold your gun and just set up those doors will open for you you don't have to open them with your hands if you do this and then draw your gun you're going to be late on the shot unfortunately so uh, set up as fast as you can Make sure you're comfortable pulling up out of there so your gun isn't getting caught on the doors. Take your time. Take your time shooting. Pick, Don't pick just pull bird. up and blast. Pick a bird. Pick a bird and make sure that one dies. And then yes. if you got time, it's go not, and do another one. It's, it's very, very unlikely that you're going to shoot all, you know, all three birds with all three shells. Kill one bird, move on to the next. Whatever birds are in front of you, shoot those. So as they come, just look at the one bird that you're wanting to shoot so when it's shots called you're already you know where you're going if we all do that we should do all right well we got mike here mike's been on how many hunts with us two or three yeah uh this is probably the third video that we're using a silencer uh mike real quickly is going to go over the entire rig that he has here and the one that he's personally shooting uh Preston will be wielding this I'll be wielding it I got Fred too so we're just going to kind of pass it around but take it away Mike and tell them what it is all right so this is an escort this is actually an escort Magnum Supreme left-handed shotgun I bought this kind of as a budget build I've done a few odds and end things to it there's a review on my YouTube channel at Realm Arms um, this is the Silencer Co suppressor this is in the full configuration of all 12 inches it has all the baffles in it you can actually take down take the baffles out of it to make it shorter if you want to but on this one i'm going to leave the long one normally it's on this 12 gauge bullpup and i've got a lot of people ask me what the pattern is on it like i said there's a youtube channel um a video we did to show this up to show how it works with this and it actually does pattern pretty good uh, the shorter bullpup gun has the 18 and a half inch barrel on it, so with that on there, it actually adds pretty good. You know, it's, it's a pretty short gun you can see compared to this one. So, anyway, we'll uh, we'll test it out today and shoot it and see how it works. Uh, so everybody's gonna ask about the magazine. All right. So, so this is it is a mag fed gun. It is plugged. You can only put two in there and then one in the chamber, just like you could with this. That's plugged as well. Um, it does have an EOTech red dot on it um, to hunt with. But yeah, so there's only going to be, I have one magazine to carry with me at all times, and there's only going to be two rounds in the mag, and then one in there, just like you would a normal farm. We got like five minutes. Uh-huh. Spread's looking good. Yeah, this, I'm just spreading it out. This uh, full body is awesome. Dude, it's unreal. I think, that, so, see the back yeah. of the blinds? Should yeah. we replace, get pull them Canada's out and go white on the back. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah. You see that black wall? We got some time. Okay, let's do it. Well, well today, me and Drew. Big spread. Preston on the right. And Big old Frederick. Bodies. Old Frederick's in his dog barn. We got full bodies all over you, buddy. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to watch out today and not nail them down here, but this is uh, the view from the lay down blind. Uh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And you, sir, are wielding the bad boy. Yep. Holy smokes. Old uh, Preston's going to be rocking the stick with uh, with the GoPro on his head, baby. I'm excited. Yeah. But we want to tell you guys, uh, man, if you haven't checked out Preston and I, it's not just mine, but our podcast, we have all the guides on there every single night. We have special guests every single, almost every single uh, podcast episode where we have clients in or like well the last episode 
Federal Ammunition. Yeah. Uh, we got to ask them all about uh, the ammo shortage and what they're trying to do to uh, fix it and get ammo out to people. But we like to uh, say what we want to over there and discuss things that I can't talk about here. And we're giving away hunts over there, everything. Uh, it's a lot of good information. So if you guys like learning stuff and getting our tips from these videos, you ought to go subscribe to the yeah. podcast. It's always linked in the description. Yeah, and the one we did with Mike. Mike, what episode did we do with you? Um, uh, Whatever it is, I don't it know. was really good. Yeah, we, it was uh, real good. Mike makes a really cool AR. We have 30 episodes up now, 31. Yep. So we're cranking out every single week. Uh, at least one goes up So on a Sunday. And so it's perfect. The giveaways. And the giveaways. We're doing a snow goose hunt giveaway uh, for conservation February here at Sand Hill with us. Uh, we're doing a spring turkey hunt giveaway. Uh, that will we'll draw for that like January. Uh, but other than that, man, we have fun over there. They're good episodes. <laughs> Shoot him over the top! Chris! Chris! What? I gotta be quicker. Dude, this thing's hard to... Hey, three low right. Right, right, right here. Good shot. This thing's so quiet. Is, is it? <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Yep, you're filming. Good deal. Good, Fred. Here. I got you. Hey, he, I don't right. think you picked that up. What? I think you didn't pick it. Yeah. Can you help me? Yep. Can you move, move these two clones to the back, back right up. and closer to these guys? Yep. He, he brought it over here. I picked it up. It's dead. Is there another one out there? No. Dude, that safety messes me up so bad. Shoot the single snow. Stop, stop, stop. stop. I lost my right contact, oh, no. my dominant eye, so this shooting's probably gonna be pretty bad. You hit it, I think. <laughs> well, I don't know. Shoot the single over the top. Okay, okay, that's good. <laughs> Shoot that bird on the, in front. That's it. Chris. Shoot the snows above you! Okay. That's a little double tap. Uh, I, I hit the horse. Did you get all fixed up? Yeah. Yeah, I can shoot. Lost your dominant eye contact? I leave contact? both eyes open, yeah. but 
just you can't even see what you're looking at. Right. It's weird. Thank God you had some in your truck I though. Know. That's a good idea. Put them in your blind bag. Extra contact. I just didn't bring it today because we didn't. I didn't want a bunch of stuff in the field. Yep. But yeah. Uh, it's sitting right at nine, nine o'clock. Uh, not going too bad. Not going too bad. Got a lot of specks on the ground. A couple snows. Heck yeah. The lessers. I don't know what happened to this roost, but there is not even half of the birds that got off of it. And I mean that. There was a bunch yesterday. <laughs> Shoot him up front! <laughs> what did? Oh, really? You gonna shoot it? Yeah. We're gonna see what it sounds like. The guys wanna hear it. Go ahead and let her rip. <laughs> that sounds so cool. It's like you can hear the action so much more. Yeah. That is sweet. What a beauty. Shoot your shoot that one. This one? Yep. Look at that beauty. Oh my God, that was not quiet. <laughs> that was not quiet at all. Ooh, well, it's the next day. We didn't do enough shooting for y'all. I'm bringing y'all on this hunt. I'm gonna do some shooting today because in the silencer video in that hunt, I didn't get to shoot. I ran the dog, so here we go. It's firing up, y'all. Let's roll. That's it. He going down. Good shooting. That was not me. Ooh, Archer's gonna be on a long one. Gosh, how far did it go? Long way. It's right in there somewhere. How many yards is he at right now? You think? If you were to guess. This is a half mile field. He's at at least a quarter mile. <laughs> God, Archer's unreal, man. I don't think he got it though. Yeah, that was tough. Oh, Archer. Gerald's dog. He gets down. Yeah, yeah, good shooting, guys. That one was already falling, but I had to finish him off. Nope. Watch that one. Oh, I thought you got him. Load up, get down. I didn't shoot very good there. I really didn't. I don't know what was wrong. Woo, here we go. Keep calling. They're coming. <laughs> Nice! Beautiful guys! Tell me that wasn't sweet. Good shooting there, boys. Well that was awesome. They came around the back right over the head. Bloop! They went down. That was awesome. They're working Archer. great. They wanted to land behind us beside Gerald, dude. They, I thought that they were gonna land on the other side of the tall socks. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>
First shot, dude. It went bloop. Going after them snows. Always gotta try. on your phone real quick and save it. Awesome. What do we feel? Woo! That was a volley, boys. Man, that's a good one. Hope y'all are enjoying it. If you are, please, you know what to do. All right, we got a walker and the decoys. We just got done shooting. This bird won't leave. You're gonna go have to be the warden and kick his butt out. Just he, walk up to him and whenever you feel like you can shoot him, shoot him. He owes you rent and you need to take him out. Get ready to shoot him. He might jump on you. Don't, nope, shoot the decoy, it don't matter. Nice, that was a headshot. Ooh, hit him again. Oh, he's definitely dead now. Go grab him. You never know. He might be banded. Wouldn't that be something? Wouldn't that be something? Band? No band. Might want to wring his neck real good. Looks like he's not all the way there. I can. Here you go. All right. Thank good you. shot. Yeah. Is that fun? Yeah. Good. Tell everybody your name, where you're from. Caleb Whistle. Now from Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. You've been what you said you've been watching the channel for about four years. Yep. That's awesome, man. I appreciate it, dude. Yeah. Thanks for coming. Glad you're here. Woo! Well, it's getting rowdy. Here's the spread. We got four clones in front. I'm really thinking the clones in front of us help a lot. I'm really thinking the clones in front help a bunch. Oh, absolutely. There's no wind. They're coming from behind us in front of us left of us yeah oh god he yeah he's good. yeah he's nasty he's nasty slept in today I dude the days I sleep in it seems they have like we've had good really good hunts that I've been on but the best ones are like the best goose hunts are the ones I slept in on yeah it's all right though you got some stuff done a lot you we're got three videos on. ahead you got revamped on. yeah we're three videos ahead as you all know Preston edits everything uh, so if you guys haven't followed Preston guys go over to Instagram follow him right here we got a goal for Preston we need to get him over 20k he deserves it. He deserves every single bit of it. Uh, but this is probably the third or fourth hunt where you're like, Bob, I'm just going to stay back today and edit and get ahead. And it was an amazing hunt. The, uh, the suppressor, what do you feel about the suppressor? Uh, out of A-frames, it's way easier to shoot. But shooting out of the layout blinds is so hard. Because it's front heavy. Pull, yeah. So, like, 
you're kind of using the front of the gun to help open that thing. You know what I'm talking yeah. about? Well, that thing, it's like even more, man, the fr it's probably pretty terrible shooting. It's way worse than like having a big tube on your gun. Yes, it's way worse, out. way worse, because it sticks out way further. It's hard to be accurate on birds. And another thing with that gun is it's a left-handed gun, so the safety's backwards. Trying to, I'm every time, I don't click the safety till I'm shouldered. Mm -hmm. And when I'm unshoulder it, I'm hitting the safety back with my thumb. Mm -hmm. But every day, it was, or every time I pulled up, it was backwards, and I had to rethink about it every oh, time. Yeah, since, that's, that's you know things. what I mean? But that's why, that's why if you ever buy a gun, don't buy a used left-handed gun if you're right. You need to get a right-handed. Yeah. gun. I've done that before. Really? Oh, I'll buy it. Yeah, it was a nice gun, and I wanted a new semi-automatic, and quickly I got rid of it because it same thing. Ejected right you across can't your do, face yeah, too would nasty. drive me nuts. Take your lips off for goodness sakes. Uh, but today was amazing. Uh, I hope you guys appreciated. Uh, you know, making this video longer on another hunt. Um, it was perfect. It was a perfect little deal. I hope you guys have been enjoying the content. Um, if you have any questions regarding the suppressors, uh, the shotgun, anything that P. Diddy was using, because um, you all know I didn't, I didn't shoot the gun during the suppressor video. I ran Fred and then today I shot. So if you guys like all of it, smash the thumbs up button, hit the notification bell because it helps us out. The more people that we can get to click on these videos, mm -hmm. guess what? Being a hunting YouTube channel, it's not always easy. They, they like want, to. If they want more of the suppressor. Yeah, they want more suppressor. If you want more of that, we, we can make that happen for sure. Right. But subscribe if you guys have not uh, hunting videos all season long. All of our tips, exactly what we're doing. Uh, again, if you have anything that y'all want us to show you drop a comment down below and let us know we both read all the comments and we enjoy and appreciate all of your guys's input because sometimes especially with guiding clients we're busy we're busy and we don't we don't get to sit down and really come up with new ideas so if you guys have an idea let us know but you need to follow this man on instagram let's get him to 20k come on y'all he deserves it that'd be cool yeah it would but until next time